Hello everyone, my name is Nguyen. I'm a student from class 11C4 on the high school. To begin with this video, let's play a small game with me. You will see the pictures and tell me where is it. You have 5 seconds. Your time is off, is the answer what I'm thinking too? That's right, this is Aizan province, a model of hometown. And today, I'm really honored to take part in the competition. As I in my heart, and tell you some characteristic about my birthplace. If someone asks you about Anzang, what will you think of? Some people say that this place is famous for bánh xèo, cơm tấm, or that some people think that there are many beautiful golden vast fields here. If you say so, this means you still don't understand all about Anzang. Anzang is a place that you must visit once in your life. Anzang is a province with a long history. It's been about 190 years since Anzang was established in 1832. In the period of formation and development, Anzang has had turning points in the process of promoting the potential of the region. Anzang is a province in the southwest region of Vietnam. Located in a position where the river and her river meet each other, these two rivers make the soil there become rich in mineral. For that reason, Anzang has a great potential in developing agriculture. When you come to Anzang, you see a lot of beautiful golden vast field stretching on the carpet, which is a favorable image of this province. In addition to developing agriculture, Anzang province still has many traditional craft villages such as Tong Chau Suk village. Cham Kimeljuri. With a history more than a few centuries, they passed on how to make the handicraft from generation to generation. These villages continue to maintain the beauty of traditional labor of Anxan people. Anxan are the number of specialties that are to be specific to this region, such as right fish. Mum, bún cá in châu đốc, thốt nốt products in tri tôm, a fried cigarette bubbles in chợ mới. This is completely suitable for those who are passionate about discovering the country cuisine and learning the beauty of national identity. There are mainly four cultures of four ethnic groups, including Kinh, Cham, Khmer, and Hoa. They live in harmony and create a friendly and peaceful human society in Anzang. Besides, Anzang has many traditional festivals that attract many people. For example, Yusu Lady Festivals, which is held every year in the fall of lunar month, and bull racing festivals in the 8th of lunar month are interesting and exciting activities for visitors. Nature in Anzang is said to be very favorable for tourism development. If you are a nature lover, then touch your forest in the Nbin district is a place you should not miss. This is an ecotourism area that attracts a lot of visitors. Moreover, Anzang is famous for its majestic mountains. Among them, Ikam Mountain, with the tallest Maitreya Buddha statue in Vietnam. Currently, I'm living in Chiang Mai district. A district has been utterly contributing to the development of the whole province. Nowadays, when talking about Yat Mai, the first much mentioned place in Mi Lung Ecotourum's area. If you are a photography lover, then this is a place you cannot miss. There are many beautiful and stunning shooting angles, making the people fall in love with the beauty of nature here. In addition, Yat Mai is also famous for a newly established ecotourism area called Gom Eng in Tam Mi Kamu. With many beautiful landscapes, in my opinion, the Anzang government should focus on perfecting the tourism potential, including the natural and social environment, and we should raise the people awareness of building a rich and strong homeland, continue to improve the agriculture production methods or creatives to support the people's life. In short, I believe that Anzang is a great place to live and interesting to visit. Remember to visit this province when you have time and you will never regret.